We're starting again. Welcome to episode one of my brand new hardcore world. You may be wondering what happened to my last world. Well, I didn't die. I did something much worse. I deleted my entire world by resetting my PC and I forgot to back it up. So enjoy this montage of some of my favorite moments from the world. All right, guys, here we go. Lockdowns, hardcore world. 100,000 blocks. We're going to be building a planet. This is so overpowered. Yes, dogs, kill it. <laughs> yes. Um, but it's actually golden carrots. Here you go, Mark. Oh my god. Oh my god, what the hell? Anyways, now it's carrot time. All right, guys, we've managed to get the entire thing drained. One like equals one tenth of a carrot planted. Anyways, on with the video. I've thought about this a lot and there is nothing I can do. So we're going to have to start a new world and make it even better. Oh, a rabbit. It's tradition to kill a rabbit on the first episode. Come here. <laughs> All right, that counts. Yeah, there's nothing we can do. So we're going to have to start again. I've learned a lot from my first series. So we're going to make this one even better. Now let's collect some wood. Oh my god, is that a zombie? Where is it? Oh, there's a cave right here. Oh, that's pretty scary. I'm just gonna run. We need stone and we're in a bad biome for stone. Ooh, a lava pool. Oh my god, that's high. Oh, there's stone there though. Let's get ourselves a wooden pickaxe. And let's munch a huge amount of this stone. Okay, we've got stone. Now we need food because... Hardcore mode is the only mode where you can actually die of starvation. Uh, and we don't have our massive carrot farm to help us this time. Oh no, we're literally at the point where we can't run. This is not the best biome for food. This is actually such a hard spawn. Oh my god. There's a cool looking cave down there, but we need food. Surely we're not going to die on the first episode. Oh my god. Wait. Yes, a village. Let's make it to the village. Hopefully it doesn't go night before we make it there. Oh my god. It's so close to being night. We gotta get moving. Ooh, I know what to do. All right, let's craft ourselves a boat real quick. Oh my God, it's going night. No. Run, 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 run. Let's get there and let's sleep. So no mob spawn, hopefully. Oh no, it's getting dark. Squids get out of the way. Oh, there's gonna be so much food here. Look at all the hay. All right, let's get in a house and go to sleep. Let me in. I need food. Excuse me, sir. Good night. All right, here we are in the village. Let's grab some food. I saw some hay bales over this way. I don't think any mob spawned, which is amazing. Okay, let's grab all this hay. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Mmm, yummy bread. Oh, that's much better. Now, where is that iron golem gone? I want to give him a nice little surprise. The surprise of death. Where's he gone? Hello, sir. Oh my god! Oh my god! Run, 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 run. Okay, that is why you don't fight an iron golem on uneven ground. Where is he? There he is. Is he still angry? Or have you forgotten? Are you okay? All right, I'm gonna just keep my eye on him. I need to get his attention and pull him away from all this. Okay. No, he's doing the same thing again. This guy's so smart. What the hell? It's not fair. We've got a genius iron golem. Okay, come here. All right, you're dead now. There's no way you can get me. Ah, there we go. Oh, he gave me five iron. He was a juicy boy. All right, okay, we are going to make ourselves a nice little shield because that is going to help us survive. And now to pillage the rest of the village. Oh, that rhymes. We'll take this bed. Oh, we'll take this bed. Looks nicer. Mmm. Okay. Ah, uh, screw it. We'll take all the beds. Barrels? Yeah, sure. I'll take some barrels. This is going to be useful. Whoa. Is this new? This looks so cool. Is this a new house? I've never seen one of these houses before. Oh my God, so much bread. Have you guys seen these before? Is that a new thing or am I stupid? Anyways, let's check out that desert temple. Hopefully, we might be able to get some diamonds already. And let's be very, very careful not to set off the TNT. That would be bad. Okay, let's mine that. Do what we got. Gunpowder. Always take that. We'll take some bones. Some string. Why not? Ooh, more iron. Golden horse armor that I'm not going to take. 
More gunpowder, bones, and string. And diamonds, please. Ooh, oh my god. Two enchanted golden apples. <laughs> That's way better than diamonds. Oh my god. Even one is insane. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> we'll take that. Oh my god. All right, so we're definitely not going to die now. That's good, I think. I think we can't die. Imagine if we find a way to die with an enchanted golden apple. All right, now I just want to find a good biome. I don't really like the desert, and I don't really like the mesa biome. So let's go on a mission to find ourselves a nice little place to build our starter house. I've got so many big things that I wanted to do in the last series, but we're going to have to do them in this. So we're going to make a lot of progress really fast. So be sure to keep watching and leave a like if you want to see episode two. Oh my god, is that another desert temple? Imagine if I've just ran in circles. Ooh, that is scary. We're going to stay away from there. I've just realized I completely forgot to get the TNT from the other temple. Uh, we'll go back another time. Okay, round two. Diamonds. Okay, nice. We'll take some emeralds. Got one diamond. A normal golden apple. Oh. Uh, projectile protection one. No. And diamond horse armor. We'll take that. Okay. Our inventory is getting quite full. Oh, and we nearly forgot the TNT again. All right. It's about to go nighttime, I think. But we're going to head this way and we'll sleep on the way. And we'll just keep going until we find a nice little biome. And actually, first, let's be safe and craft ourselves one of these. Yes, I am using string to clear this out. <laughs> Alright, screw that. Ooh, a jungle. Hmm, that's kind of cool. Oh, another biome. Okay, this could be good. I love how green this biome is. It wouldn't be a lockdown life video without killing some horses. I like this area. It's pretty cool. It's very flat, which is good for building. I kind of want to see some mountains. All right, so that snow is all the snow that you sink in. So I'm kind of thinking if we fill this up with cobblestone and then we can place like little bits of snow on top, then we should be able to build our giant igloo on top of it and it will look really cool. Okay, let's do this. So we'll turn this stuff into slabs. Then we'll build out like this, I think. All right, that should be the outline of the igloo. Now let's fill in the floor. All right, nice. Now we need to start on the walls. Okay, nice. That's the base layer of the walls. Now to do the next layer. So this should all be filled in like that, I think. And then this should come across along here like that. And then we need to make like a, a T sort of shape like this. And then fill in the underneath somehow. Ooh, this is going to look so cool when it's finished. I think I'm going to skip ahead to when it is finished because this is going to take a while to figure out all the dimensions and stuff. So I'll see you guys in a few minutes. All right, there we go, guys. We've got a giant igloo that's now like an exact replica of the naturally spawning igloos in like snowy villages. Now I just want to kind of like fill in these gaps with some real snow just so you can't see the cobblestone. I'm actually going to get rid of these as well. So let's do that real quick. And then the more it snows, the more natural it's going to look, which is really cool. As you can see, like the snow is already starting to like build on stuff, which is pretty cool. So it's going to look a lot more natural. All right, there we go. We still need to decorate the inside of our base and we need to go on a mission to get some sand so that we can make some blue stained windows which will go very nicely with the whole igloo aesthetic. I also want to put some barrels around the place, get some crafting tables, get some furnaces and everything set up. So let's first go to sleep real quick. Where should we put our bed? 
This is a nice little area. I think this is quite cozy for now. We'll put another bed over here. But yep. Yeah. Now it's the morning. Let's head out. Go grab our stuff from our barrel over there. And try and find some sand. I don't know where sand will be. But we'll try and find it. Oh no. Ow! Oh my god, a fully golden zombie. We need some more food as well. Alright, that's food sorted at least. Let's chuck some of this stuff in here. Grab some wood. Grab everything that we need to go and find some sand. Perfect. And let's head out and find some sand. This is one of the main reasons I wanted to build over here. Because look at these giant cliffs. They're so tall. And they go all the way around in a nice little circle. So we're going to have to build some really cool things around there. That's going to look sick. And this is even a really steep cliff here as well. I think we're going to drop down and then try and find some sand somewhere else. Whee! <laughs> there's got to be some sand somewhere. Alright, there's a little bit of sand here. It's not much, but it should hopefully be enough for the windows. Let's just see how much there actually is. We'll grab all of it. Yeah, this should be enough for the windows. Alright, that'll do. And there's also a shipwreck over there, so let's go check that out. Oh my god, is that an ocean monument? Alright, we're definitely going to drain that in a future episode, just like our old world. And we're going to do something really cool with it. I had something really cool planned in my last series, but as you know, we didn't get to do it, sadly. But we will do something even better in this series. Ooh, here's the treasure map. Ow! Alright, that's enough of that. Let's head back. See, look how massive that cliff is. And that one's even taller. Oh my god. This is such a cool area. I'm so glad I found it. Alright, here we are back home. Let's chuck down some of these. Yeah, that looks alright for now. We will put down some furnaces. Let's just chuck them there. A smoker. Where should we put that? We'll just put it here for now. And let's get some of this glass cooking. Nice. Alright. And while that's all cooking, we will put everything away and go grab the rest of our stuff. Alright, here we are. We got another barrel to chuck down. Let's chuck all this stuff in there. We will... We need to get some kind of door going. I don't think a normal door will look good though. So, get a crafting table. We will chuck that over here. Uh, how do you make a fence gate? Perfect. Actually, we're going to need two of those. Alright, nice. So, I think two little fence gates there. Yeah, I think that looks alright. Oh, but it's not going to stop the baby zombies, so let's move it down. There we go, nice and safe. Yeah, spiders can still get over. Ah, uh, who cares about spiders? The main security feature that we're missing, though, is windows. So let's grab our blue flowers. Let's turn it into blue dye. Then let's dye some of this glass. How would you do it again? Okay, nice. And we've got some blue stained glass. Can we turn it into paint? Yes, we can. All right, let's do that. Perfect. And let's do these windows, make it look like I sort of, I think it looks quite nice. It goes with it nicely. Perfect. I feel a lot safer now. And it's quite cozy with these campfires as well. Oh, that kind of looks cool, but yeah. All right, we'll chuck these in here. I think next episode, we'll definitely have to get ourselves a horse. All right, and one last thing. I want to get rid of this powdered snow and just put some kind of pathway to over there because this is really annoying because look what happens every time I go and try to get over there. This happens every single time. It's so annoying. And then I have to break everything, nearly die, somehow block myself in. It's not fun. So let's make a nice little path. And there we go, a nice safe pathway to our igloo. Very nice. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in episode two. Goodbye.